In this video, I'll be comparing the email marketing platforms Omnisend versus Klaviyo in relation to its functions for e-commerce businesses. So I'll personally be giving my recommendation on which platform I actually think is better. Currently, I am not affiliated with either company, so you can trust that this is a pretty unbiased review, but in the future, I will be trying to partner with my favorite one, which will be revealed in the later part of this video. So we've worked with a bunch of actual brands who are not dropshippers, by the way, uh, across various niches. So I feel like I'm slightly more qualified to give this advice. And I'll be going over both the pros and cons with respect to different categories, and you'll find timestamps linked in the video below. You can skip ahead to whatever part you're interested in, but I actually recommend you watch till the end of this video as different platforms actually better for different categories. First of all, let's talk about pricing. Omnisend has three different pricing tiers. They have the standard, which is, I believe, what's known as Omnisend Lite. They have the pro and the enterprise level, whereas Klaviyo only has one tier. Omnisend is cheaper when you compare it to Klaviyo on the standard plan. However, for the pro plan, Omnisend is actually more expensive. Overall, Omnisend beats Klaviyo in terms of pricing as they offer different tiers. However, I actually wouldn't base the decision at all and I wouldn't be influenced by pricing whatsoever when it comes to your email marketing platform because the difference is pretty much marginal relative to how much you can generate through the platforms. When it comes to software integrations, both platforms have a huge list of software that you can easily integrate with. However, Klaviyo's list is actually much larger than Omnisend. But for the most part, you know, if you're the average e-commerce business, all of the core apps that you would use will be on both platforms. However, Klaviyo does have the larger list of softwares to integrate with. So if you're a store out there that has a really, really big tech spend, then I would highly recommend you go with Klaviyo. But generally, Generally speaking, both Omnisend and Klaviyo will have the core integrations that you need to get started with. When it comes to reporting, this is actually something I can speak slightly more on because in my experience, Klaviyo has the much better reporting experience as they don't seem to have one of the key attribution problems that Omnisend faces. For example, one of the issues we faced with Omnisend with a client last year was to do with currency conversion. Omnisend doesn't actually allow you to convert purchases from different currencies into your native one. An example of this happened with an order from Japan for one of our clients, where instead of converting the currency from Japanese yen, which was around 7,000 Japanese yen into British pounds, it just gave 7,000 pounds worth of attribution to the actual order. This really messed with the reporting side of things as the data from Omnisense dashboard was no longer applicable. Klaviyo simply does not have this problem as it pulls data directly from Shopify. In my opinion, this issue alone was worth switching from Omnisend to Klaviyo, as if you ever have intentions of selling abroad or billing your customers in their native currency, which helps conversion rate, then definitely just go with Klaviyo. Uh, Omnisend, it was a huge headache for us to actually sort that order out. And in the end, we had to go in and manually remove it from the reporting side of things as there was actually no way to manually go in and change the order data on Omnisend. When it comes to user interface, I think it just kind of comes down to personal preference. One of the features I will say though that I really enjoy about Omnisend is when you upload media, you can just upload whole folders of images and assets at a time, whereas Klaviyo, it's more kind of, uh, you need to do it one by one kind of thing. When it comes to support, both platforms, in my opinion, have really excellent live chat support. Anytime I've had a question, they've always got back to me in a timely manner. In terms of Omnisend, you know, we had a pretty big issue when it came to currency conversion. They were really patient with working us through that issue. However, to be honest, there was just nothing they could do as it was a limitation on the tech side of things. But they eventually, you know, escalated it to the tech team, which, I mean, it never got solved, but at least they tried, right? Generally speaking, in terms of support, I'd say they're pretty even. Uh, nothing really special about either one. They both have really helpful life support. Based on my experience from running an email marketing agency dedicated to serving e-commerce brands, I can confidently recommend Klaviyo as my personal platform of choice. However, there is an asterisk. It's only my platform of choice and in my opinion, the best one out there exclusively for e-commerce businesses. If you're in any other industry, I'm not sure if it's gonna be the best one as everything on the platform is designed to drive e-commerce revenue. There are kind of several things that really sets it apart, notably when it comes to things like smart sending and also the attribution side of things. 
I really enjoy using the platform. Also, there are several advanced features that OmniSend reserves for the Pro package that Om Clavio would just give to you straight off the bat, notably things in, in terms of list segmentation, reporting, and A-B split testing. In my opinion, the currency conversion problem alone is enough for you to use Clavio simply because, I mean, if you're selling into multiple different countries, billing in different currencies, you're probably at a point where a few hundred dollars extra in tech spend wouldn't really make a dent in your margins. So I highly recommend use Clavio. If you need help with email marketing for your e-commerce store and are consistently doing at least 20,000 a month or more in revenue, book in a call with me down below and I would love to help you out.